Welcome back, my friends. My name is Eric, and this is Rome, and we're back with some more Stellar Tactics. Now, weirdly enough, I noticed that Stellar Tactics has been my my videos from a year ago have been have been getting a lot of views recently. And until the last couple of days, one of them was actually in the top ten of my videos watched for the last month, for the last twenty eight days. And so I thought, well, maybe we should take a look at it. Maybe let's see how it's doing. And uh, the game is, is fine, it's still under development, but that development has slowed quite a bit. The, the developer, I believe it's a one, one man show, um, he had put out a roadmap and he'd been pretty good about sticking to it till his winter roadmap uh, when he kind of fell off the planet for a little while. But as it turns out, according to a note that was posted, I believe yesterday to the Steam page, um, after I'd already got it installed and started playing, and going, hmm, I wonder what's going on there. Uh, his wife was diagnosed with cancer, and so they've been going through all of that stuff, and apparently she's doing okay. Uh, and speed is picking back up on the game. So I thought that we should revisit it, A, because clearly there's an interest out there on the game, and B, just to kind of help spread the word out that the game is still alive and well. It's still being developed. It was just, it slowed down for a little bit. So we're a few hours into the game. Uh, I was flying around and I'm learning about FTL and different systems. And uh, I scanned the planet and it said that there was a phage attack on a mining colony. So we're here. What is the phage, do you ask? Well, the phage is like zombie Borgs, right? It's a parasite that gets into the body. Uh, it took over Earth. Uh, four or five kind of colony ships fled, supposedly without the phage. Uh, but it was there, and one of the scientists who we are now working with um, mutated it even further in an attempt to find a cure. And uh, now it's, it's, it's developed its own consciousness that's linking. Uh, so... We are taking place in this world that has this, this kind of zombie Borg type of virus going around. Uh, on top of that, there is a multi-dimensional kind of villain prophecy type of story as well, where we're kind of one of the one of the the, the chosen ones on top of that. Um, and so there's a lot going on. This is a hugely ambitious game that not only deals with the ground combat, but also with space combat, crafting, salvaging, repair, multi-crew ships, trading. Uh, I don't know if I said mining, but mining. Um, there's a lot going on in this game. It's 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 big. So we're going to dive in here for a little bit, uh, and we're just going to play for the heck of it. Uh, the systems are um, procedurally generated at the beginning of your game. Uh, you type in a big, long string of digits, and it generates a custom uh, galaxy for you. So every playthrough should be, you know, marginally different. Now, as you can see here, we've got a series of, of cubes. This is this is the dungeon, the dungeon rooms, and each of these needs to be cleared, I believe, is how we're going to do this. So we are in the first one at the moment. Um, this is our primary character right here, Rome, and she is good with shotguns. Um, I leave her on this because it gets her a, an easy sprint. These each the the weapons have their own special abilities and they come up X number of turns, right? So this one's gonna be up in two more combat turns. But what I could do is I could use this and that's gonna give me a sprint. I don't need it in this case. We're just gonna flip over to our shotgun. And you can see that it automatically updates my attack, my points down there as I go over there. It's gonna be three, uh, it's gonna take me three action points if I want to shoot this. Now, if I right click on somebody, it's going to give me this little deal here. And you can see I can target head, torso, arms, or legs. Uh, this will cripple somebody. Uh, this will hobble somebody, <coughs> um, which will slow them down. I think crippling just gives them big uh, debuffs to their, their combat. Uh, and then we have a 2% chance to stun as well at the moment. We can change our fire mode. This weapon happens to have a burst and a full auto. Uh, although it looks like I've only got three rounds because I forgot to reload last time. So we're going to go to, uh, we've got five. You know what? We may as well see if we can get a burst out because that's that's five points. Well, that's going to leave us eight. Hold on. One. Oh, no, we've got we've got full. We've, we've got everything. So we could, you know what? I'm going to just do single shots. Um, and we'll go ahead and just aim for the torso. Let's just try to do damage here. All right, I'm gonna get out now. Uh, I have a barrier here, applies an energy field that will reflect 20% of a single attack um, and 20% shield recharge. I believe that's our blue bar under our under our under our name there. I think 
Red is armor, blue is shield, green is health, maybe? He says confidently. Um, you heal up between fights. And so I haven't really worried too much about it. I've used a couple healing things here and there, but I haven't really needed to do too much. However, if we end our turn here, we have the opportunity to defend. That's going to uh, increase our chance to avoid or mitigate a single attack. Um, or we could just end our turn. Or... We could delay our turn. I'm not sure this works because I tried it and it just felt like it skipped my turn. So I, I haven't been doing too much of it. I've just been kind of taking my shots. All right. Um, let's go ahead and just take some shots at him. I do like to double click. You can uh, aim. So you can see there I'm aiming at the head. There I'm aiming at an arm. There I'm aiming at a leg. It's sometimes kind of hard to find the torso depending on what's going on. So I tend to just right click and bring this up. Um, this shows you what type of resists they have. So in this case, he's got really good explosive resists, which is a shame because that's what type of damage this does. So I could actually think, uh, well, let me change weapons while I'm in there, but potentially I could change weapons to get something else. You can see he, he has poor electro resist. Uh, that must be what we should probably be going with, but you know what, we got what we got. So let's go ahead and torso him up here. <laughs> This game has a lot going on. It's He just kind of took a little bit of everything that he liked and tossed it in, and uh, uh, it works, I'll be honest with you. Um, you know what? How close are you to dead? I'm going to go ahead and move up here, uh, get close with a pistol. She happens to have a mini gun. Um, let me click over here to it for you. I got one, but it's not loaded, and it takes forever to load because I forgot to reload in between fights. Um it will put one bullet in. So it puts one magazine and then shoots the entire magazine. So this isn't 34 bullets. This is 34 magazines that we have for it. Um, I do have uh, this, which is great if there's multiples. But you know what? It's just one guy, and I think he's going to go down pretty quick. So I'm just going to shoot him. Uh, I was going to say shoot him in the face, but we'll shoot him in center mass. This is the turn order right here. You can see after this. Three of them get to go. Then our melee fighter gets to go. And then uh, it kind of loops back around. Um, and I'm going to... Do I have enough to reload? Not enough AP. We don't know where they are yet. They're coming. Uh, facing matters. If you can't... If you're not looking at them, you ain't going to see them. They could all be coming up behind us right now. We would not know. All right. I've got a one-handed melee and a two-handed melee. This is our one-handed. Again, it gives me that little sprint. Um, so you can see there we could potentially do uh, – here, let's right-click. Um, so this will do 14 damage if we do that. If we go ahead and we flip over to our two-hander, we have – this, but it does an AOE, and there's nobody else around him, so there's no real point in doing that. Uh, you can see this one's going to do 31 for three, whereas the other one did, what, 14 for two? So I think, ultimately, the two-hander is going to get you a better... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? It's going to get you a, a better kind of bang for the buck. <clears throat> but I do like... Sometimes, just the amount of points you have, you get m extra attacks. Um... All right, let's see where they come from. We've got one there. It's the only one we see at the moment. So I'm guessing they're coming from around the corner there. All right, so we are back to our primary person here, Rome, with her shotgun. Uh, I'm going to flip back over to our pistol here. I'm going to use my sprint. I'm going to come up to about here. And then, all right. Oh, we got dudes everywhere. All right, so we got three guys over here. One, two, three. We've got a couple more over here. Um, I'm going to go to here. Oh, my nose is itching. Allergies have been really bad the last couple days. Excuse me. It rained today, which is the only reason why I can actually see, because my eyes were so bad I couldn't see for the last last about three days. Uh, so I haven't done much. I apologize. Um, but that's why. All right. Um, I don't think I'm going to be able to do much here. Can I get a shot? I still got pretty good range with the shotgun. I'm specialized in shotgun. Pistol's my backup, my sidearm. I'm going to go ahead and use my barrier there, because there are three guys there, uh, and I'm not quite sure what's going to come in on us. Um... Again, if I flip over, I'm going to use his pistol, sprint two. 
Can I hit that guy with that? No. Okay. Flip back over to the rifle. Um, we've got what? Five? All right. And then we'll go ahead and we'll just do a regular defend on him. And now you. Um, I think actually I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to flip over to this. I am going to do a reload here. Now, the nice thing about this is this doesn't take any action points. These 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 skill points are free, um, so to speak, right? They only come up every whatever, but um, when they are up, they don't take action. So I could, in fact, well, I don't have my deal up there. I could, uh, we can get up here where we can see somebody. It's going to, and we don't have to uh, have a lot of XP spots back, right? Uh, we don't want to get shotgunned. Let me go to here because it, it doesn't take any any points. So I'm gonna go for there. That guy ate all of it on the way in. The bullets do have a presence, so they do run through things, and in this case, he soaked all of them. Um, and that's fine. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and flip back over to my pistol, and we'll, uh, we'll end our turn here. We'll see if they run in on us. Ouch, missed. Two misses in a row, but we're on fire now. Okay. All right. Um, I used my little sprint last time. Yeah. All right. Well, let's let's get up here and hit this guy in the face with a hammer. And again, there's no point to... Uh, you know what? I'm going to use it just to try to get some extra damage for free out of this. Um, you have a shotgun blast that will put some fire on him, I think. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Okay, well, hold on once again. Reload. Oh, I didn't use my ability. There we go, hold on. Uh, okay. You have some shots left. The question is, if we go, let's put our our one ability on this guy because it's a rifle. We can reach out with it. Now I'm going to switch over to my pistol. I'll use my special ability for it because it's up on this guy. See, he's got two skulls, so he's he's the nasty one here. I'll reload. There we go. There we go. Um, I'm going to defend. All right. You have the pistol up at the moment. Those three guys don't apparently see us. They're not coming in on us yet, interestingly enough. So I'm going to go ahead. See if we can get some shots from there. If we can get two shots out. Just barely. I'm going to go ahead and use our special ability. Oh, we have to reload. Never mind. Well, we'll get a shot out. We'll get the special ability out on him. These apparently seem to always hit, so maybe you're better off always going for the head on these. Not really sure. Um, but we'll go ahead and end my turn. Get a defense out as she throws fire in. Or whatever it's supposed to be. Um, T. And we'll move up here again. We'll just use our, our special ability on the, uh, on the pistol. And create a quick defend. Switch over to our one. No, we still don't have it, but can we get there? We can get there. We can do a special ability with the knife. Well, it's a, it's a hammer as well here. It's a mace. It's got a little deal there, a little whirlwind attack. And I think that's it for that. And you, um, back to the rifle. Let's just take a shot in from here. Can we finish you off from here? Nope, there's a miss. Come on. There we go. I wasn't sure if it was going to let us out of combat or not with those other three guys that we could clearly say, hey, we got a level up. We get an EVA helmet clamp. Okay. Uh, lots of loot, kind of Diablo style loot. Um, oops, there we go. They are back in here now. Um, 
I'm going to go to C real fast. And again, and uh, I don't know, more of a, a skill. I was going to try to think of a game, but I've just blinked on the name of it. Um, the more you use something, the better your skills go up on. So we're, our skills are going up as we use these things. We have stats, which help some of them, but they go up as we go. All right, so I'm going to reload. Then I'm going to switch. I'm going to reload. And I'm just going to All defend. Right, you know what to do. I don't think they see us yet, so I think I have the chance here to uh, just do reloads on everything. Is it just R on this? I think it's R. So I'm going to take the chance here. Oh. Oh. Two-handed melee level five. Well, we're nowhere near that, but that's a good pistol. Hmm, I wonder, I don't think I, uh, well, maybe we'll have to see if we have anybody with a three in pistols. All right, uh, let's switch over to the pistol. Speaking of which, do a quick reload there. And I'm going to go ahead and defend. I do also have grenades. Um, a bunch of them. Need to use them more often. Get a defend. All right, do they see us? They come. Oh, they did see us. Okay, that's fine. They appear to be mostly melee so far. Although it was initiates that were throwing fire at us last time, so maybe not. All right. Um, you can sprint. So I'm going to have you sprint to here. And then I'm going to defend. You are going to actually throw a grenade. I know I just talked about that. So I've got a bunch of different types of grenades. I've got frag grenades. I've got stun grenades, EMP, gas, and smoke. We're going to throw a stun grenade out here um, because we can. And I think that'll get all three of them. And it will, in fact, stun them for a certain amount of time. Uh, and now I'm just going to move up because she's got the shotgun. It's not super long range. It, it can get into here, but... Um, and then you are going to maybe, I don't know, I can hit you right here, right there, yeah? Getting a little nice area effect going on there. Flip over to the rifle. And we'll just take some regular torso shots here. Again, two skulls on this one, so he's the difficult one of the group. Um, and you, I think, we've got the minigun loaded. Sure. 11 times 8. So we could get 88 out of this. I almost never see anything above about a 40, but let's see. 34. All right, they're stunned. And now, uh, I'm going to switch over to the big axe, or the big hammer. There we go. Uh, shotgun. You can see he's stunned for one more round. I think that's the, the one on his face there. And we'll go ahead and get maybe we'll finish off this initiate. We did. Nice crit. There we go. All right. Flip back over to her pistol. Use her sprint. Get nice and close for the pistol. We have a special ability. May as well go for head since. I've yet to miss with a, a special ability, so. Ah, uh, Grace, there we go. Put him down, nice. All right, we have a we have a level up, which is what I wanted to get to. Him. Ooh, there's some cool stuff there. It comes in very slowly there when you get your stuff. We'll take a look, see what we got in a minute here. Do we pick everything up? No. No. 
And again, you'll see we, we were healing up as we went. We'll get everything back. She's got to level up. Let's go ahead and take care of that first. Um, she's the melee character? Yes. All right. So we're going to put some points into strength. We're going to put a point into agility. We're going to put a point into endurance. Um... Increases your chance to hit and provides a bonus to critical hit. Sure. We'll put a little into there. Okay. Let's take a look at equipment see if we got anything good here. Um, she could potentially... She can't use it yet. Uh, let's take a look see where her, her melee is. So her one-handed is at three. Her two-handed is at two. Um, it's been going kind of slow. I, maybe you should put points into intelligence because intelligence does increase the speed at which you gain your, your, your experience there. Um, but for the moment... So that we can't use yet. I'm going to go ahead and move it into my stash, which means it's it's not I'm not it's not weighing me down. It's not taking up spaces, but we can't use it in the middle of a fight either. We've got a pretty cool little pistol here. I'm going to go ahead and repair that. Uh, Rome is my, my I've got repair parts, and then we get XP as we do it on top of that. So generally speaking, I try to repair almost everything, even if I'm going to take it apart in a minute just to get the XP. Hardened spikes. Pugilism level four. That's pretty cool. Um, we don't have anybody that has pugilism, but you can go hand to hand with, you know, gloves and spikes and stuff if you like. Um, I'm going to go ahead and repair that, and then we will put this on somebody. Um, sure, why not? So this is going to get her a bonus to strength. Uh, that pistol. Is it a better shield than she has? Well, we can repair it regardless. Quick repair. Um... Six charges, charge rates two. Uh, no, I don't think that's better. In fact, I don't think that's better than anybody. We're going to go ahead. We're going to salvage those. Um, I think we'll probably salvage this pistol too. It's just a level one. Um, it's not terrible. It's got a mod slot, so I guess there's that. Um, yours does not have a mod slot. It does not. We'll go and do a quick repair on it. Uh, 11 to 18. This one does more damage, but this one gets a mod slot. So let's go for that. Uh, rifle grip, that doesn't help us at the moment. Armor, it's actually better than what you got, so sure. Uh, exceptional combat helmet. Again, better than you have. So we'll go ahead and do that. We're going to repair this one, and then we're going to go ahead and we're going to we're gonna salvage that one as well. I think we'll salvage those gloves. And let's see. I think my main character has a sidearm... She does, but it doesn't have a mod slot. Does any? These are your mod slots here, and they are weapon dependent. So he does. She's got a perception there. All right. So you're the only one with a pistol mod slot at the moment. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look at her stash, because I think I have a few in here. Pistol grip. I've got a grip, and I've got a magazine for pistols. Or uh, I've got a couple magazines. Whoops, no. Um, so that will get us what? An additional 12, an additional 14. Don't, uh, they're all random. So, I mean, it's rare, but it's still only his 12. Whereas this one's 14. So this is definitely the one we're going to use if we use one. Um, and then I thought we had a grip in here too. Oh, it's a rifle grip there. Um, Pistol grip right here. So that's plus one dex, plus one chance to hit. Or just a boatload of ammo on it. Um, I think I'm just going to go with the extra 14. Whoops, that's not what I wanted. Um, we'll drag it in. Oh, come on. Um, that one's worth some cash. I'm going to sell it. Uh, and this one, though, is not worth anything, so we'll go ahead and take it. Whoops. Oh, damn, damn it. There we go. Uh, and you, I think I'm going to hang on to you. I don't know. Who, if we get somebody that does pugilism, we could use that. All right, so let's go to take a look at salvage. So we'll add some junk. Uh, and so now we can go ahead. I'm just going to say disable all. I've got three options. One is just 
lowest failure rate, we don't learn anything, we don't have a chance for schematics. This one, slightly higher failure rate, but there's a chance we're going to learn some, get something, uh, or, and a small chance for a schematic, and this is the highest rate of failure, but the highest rate to get a schematic, learning how to actually build something. So we're going to go ahead and click through there real quick, and you can see we get ex we get percentages, so we're 31% towards basic rifle, right? But we're only 1% towards an exceptional. Then we'll be able to build these. Now, I haven't built anything because it does require a fair amount of mining, or at least make getting ores and alloys done, and I haven't done that yet. But I have been working on it, so you can see we've got a handful of schematics unlocked, including a basic heavy flamethrower, which I would really like. Um, and you can see we just slowly build up everything, you know, all the regular equipment, but also the augmentations for the weapons. All right. Um, map. I'm lost. Let's go west. Let's clean out this section over here in case there's any loot or anything over here. It was a chest, but not one that we can click on. This might take this. This is going to be a long one, I think. I think this will go green as soon as we clear it out. Is that door to another section? No. Okay. Looks like the one door would be to the south. Is that any of these openable? Nope. Tab will uh, highlight stuff that's openable, by the way. I'm just kind of zigzagging my way through here. There we go. We got four dudes. Oh, what are those? I have no idea what these are. Now, this might be the extra dimensional threat, right? The threat that's occurring across all dimensions and all universes at once. And there's this gem. It's actually called Gem, J-H-E-M, uh, that floated around and said I was a chosen one. And if I can find all their temples, they'll give me special abilities. There we go. Close enough to kick off. But this is the first time I've seen the demons themselves. So, not much explosive resist. Very little kinetic resist. Okay. Um, I wonder how fast they move. I think I'm just going to take this first turn, just kind of sprint up. I'll leave myself two points to do a defend. Um, you could probably just start shooting this guy right now. Yeah, the rifle has pretty good range. Did I re reload last time? I don't remember. I always forget to reload. Um... I did not. I will here. Uh, and I get, I have a free uh, ability up at the moment. So I might move up here and actually use it on somebody. Okay, again. I don't see how big numbers very often with it, but you know, they do have some resist. You can see raw damage was 33 minus resist minus armor, you know, so it is what it is. Oh, they got some movement on them. They got some wheels. Uh, there's at least five of them. One just is trying to flank us around to the side here. I saw it scoot this way. All right, but we're gonna use some grenades is what we're gonna use. Oh, actually, um, you've got an ability up. Um, maybe a frag grenade right there. Um, 
They didn't like that. I don't know why not. I'll use this. That'll get me to here. Then I can use this special ability, which hits both. Then I can switch back. I've got a special ability here. Get a little bit more damage on the AoE. All right, now the shotgun. Well, I wasn't really trying to go for the head, but see, sometimes it's hard to find the torso, so I'm just going to right-click there. Oh, not enough AP. Um, all right, that's fine, because I will use that for defense in case he comes after me. Nope. There was another one over here somewhere. I could have sworn it. I need to be looking, but at the moment, I'm going to try to take care of this little guy. I'm actually going to turn to look this way, just in case somebody comes around there and do a defend. I do still have two here. Hmm. You guess just you and you at the moment. All right, flip back to our pistol. Oh, he's a dangerous little guy, huh? Oh, I didn't mean to go for the head. Wow, wow. Oh, there we go. I told you. Um. Hammer has a little bit of reach. Hey, our two enemy has gone up. You know, I'm actually going to switch over, and we'll get one more attack out of the, the little one. Oh, no, he's dead. Never mind. Uh, that is three. If I go here, I'm going to go ahead and put special odd on him then we'll just do a regular shot and we'll end our turn there shotgun skills gone up nice you know what let's go ahead let's see what a burst would do for us um fire mode burst we just have single and burst let's do a burst I only hit with one of them oh well But he did get a improved. His rifle skills has gone up. That's nice. All right, one more person to go before he does. Um, you know what? I'm gonna do a reload. Move it here, defend, because she's the one that's taking any damage. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. Down he goes. All right. Flamethrower in paradise. Actually, I don't know if that's what it is. It just, I don't know, it's kinetic. So it's a mini gun of some sort. It requires big guns level two. Okay. Apparently our big guns isn't up to level two yet. Ooh, exceptional armor. Level four hammer. Okay. Good loot. More pugilism. An SMG. I don't have anybody that uses an SMG. I'm wondering if maybe we should give somebody an SMG. Just so we take advantage of that stuff, right? Let's let's take a look. Um, you know who you we could use it on? Let's use it on our heavy weapons expert. We've been doing the pistol with her, but let's go ahead, um, shift click to get rid of that. Let's give her an SMG. 
that way, if we get some cool ones, we can do that. Uh, there's no mod on that one, unfortunately, which is a little annoying, but um, do I have any? Okay. This is a good, this is a decent mod, but we'll, we'll just put it in the stash for now. Uh, same with that. Uh, better armor, but not for you. Uh, I don't know. Maybe we are. You've got three or nine. You've got that. Now, it is an addition to agility, which I think is best for melee. So, yeah, I think we will. We will do that. I should repair it, though. Hold on. Um, oh, it doesn't really need much, does it? As long as we're here. There we go. Now, that requires level four. One-handed four. I think we're up to, th oh, I don't know, but we'll go and put it in the, in the stash for now. Uh, this one, um, it's not really worth much. I'm gonna go ahead and we'll salvage that next time I get a chance. Uh, that needs some repair too, huh? 2460, it says it's better. Um, I don't think it is. 29 and 29, 30 and 29, nine versus 12. So it's actually a couple worse, at least than what you have. Um, how about you, what do you have? Uh, that's pretty darn good too, at least by total numbers. Better than what you have though. There we go, and we'll go ahead and, this one's not worth much either, so I'll go ahead and put it on the salvage list. You, um, you're still big guns level one. It's not significantly better. We'll just keep it out. If, if we, we get to a point to sell it, we will, um, because it's got one slot, but so does this. Whoops, excuse me. Um, and it just does like three damage, 17 to 88 versus 16 to 85. There's not much difference. Uh, it has less range. Uh, ammo is still the same. Yeah, I don't, I don't see a reason to, to care if I'm honest. Uh, and it's worth reasonable money. So I think maybe actually I'm going to go ahead and we'll mark it for sale. Okay. We're still not green though. So that means there's still stuff to fight out here somewhere, but let's see if there's loot in any of this. Ah, oh, there's not. Dang it. Uh, that's where we came in, right? Okay. A little bit turned around at this point, but I don't think we've been here. Oh, there's something. Data drive. Ah, uh, and a bad shield. Oh, you know what we need to do? Let's do a reload. There we go. I kind of figured there'd be a fight up here. All right. There's four of them total. Get up here and put a shotgun blast in, do you? Another one coming in. Still the ways back, though. Um, a little bit close for you. What if we switch over to the pistol? Uh, I'm going to hold off on you. Let's go ahead and try your uh, submachine gun for the first time here. How about that? We got burst. Right into the torso here. We're going to right click real fast here. Um, 39, 60, 
Yeah, let's go right in there. Uh, how many fire modes do we have? Does this one just burst? This one's burst or full auto? Let's go burst. <laughs> we only got one hit out of those eight shots. Uh, yeah, that's what I, th I think that's all we got. Uh, let's, but we got another one here. A little bit more that time. Well, there's at least five of them. Looks like five of them. Well, it could be more. It looks like there's more off the screen. There's room for stuff off the screen there. We see one, two, we see five of them so far. All right, well, I'm going to go ahead and click this. I'm going to step up to here. I'm going to hit you with this. Then I should be able to get up to here. Do we have our special up for this yet? No, we do not. Okay, but that's okay. Shotgun. Uh, do we have our, we have our special move. Let's move up to here. I'm going to go ahead and use this. Switch over to the shotgun. Go ahead and pop my shield there just in case. End of my turn. Um, is that guy almost dead? Not really. That's a good shot. Can we get another one of those? Can we get him with a pistol? I think we're too far away. Too far away. Oh, well. SMG. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use your move. Did I leave myself enough to get a shot here? All right. Two down, three to go. We're doing okay. And there comes the fire. Nice big crit. Switch over to the little one. Finish off our action points. We could have done defense there as well, but maybe we should have. Oh, no, he went the other direction. All right. Well, I'm not sure that was a good move on your part, buddy, but... Shotgun. Switch over to our pistol. Ooh, not much of a chance there. You know what? We're just going to do a defense instead. Get our special ability up. 59. He's just getting kind of out, out of range there on us. I'm going to move up a little bit with my last couple points. Um... Let's dump this into you, because you look like you're kind of a pain in the ass. A whole 15 points of damage. Now, to be fair, it did 38 and just resisted a lot. But still. Um, all right. Oops. All right. So we're going to get a little bit closer. How about now? Hobbled. Let's get our special ability out. And then we'll put some defense up, just in case. Now, they can walk past you, but if they're engaged in combat and they try to get out and you have a melee, you do get a melee attack. So there is some area control. Switch over to the big one because we don't have to move very far to hit him with it. Actually, I have a chance to put some damage on you. A little, 
little bit surprised the shotgun reached out that far, but that's okay. Uh, and you are getting kind of close to the end of yours, too. I'm just going to sprint you up to here. If you up, are you in pistol range? Eh. Or SMG range, as the case may be. Out, that all hurts. It burns. It really, really burns. All right. Use our sprint. Uh, I'm not going to say... I'll save the whirlwind. See what type of loot we get. One more. Quick. Uh, reload. All right. That is level five. Hard to repair. That's what it is. Um, I'll toss it into the stash for now. You're also level five and also damaged, but apparently much easier to repair. We'll toss that in there. All right, this one, nope. Nope, those are crap. Um, pistol SMG by 16, that's pretty good. Conrare shotgun, okay, so that'll get us a, a, a single, that'll give us a burst on our shotgun if we want it. I'll hang on to it for now. Um, Uh, kinetic, more pub We're getting a lot of pugilism stuff, huh? Uh, that's just basic, though. I'm going to go ahead and we'll we'll salvage that one. Um, I'm going to, again, we'll go ahead and do repairs when we can. I don't think anybody's going to need this one. Uh, it's not worth a huge amount, so I'll salvage that. Uh, this one's worth pretty good money, though. Look at that, 10. Uh, you know what? We'll give it to you. You seem to get attacked a lot. We'll get just more strength and intelligence. Uh, actually, strength would be you. Um, yeah, let's go that route. And then is this better than what you have? No, it does get an additional agility, though. I don't think that matters. It's not worth much. We'll go ahead and repair that one, too. Um, or uh, salvage it. And that one's not worth anything. So we'll fix it just for the XP. And then we're going to go to salvage, and we're going to add our junk items in there too. Disable all, and just do a quick... Get in there, almost up to level 8. A little surprised at this point that we don't have this section cleaned out. It's going to be a big dungeon. Some of these dungeons, I have noticed, are pretty good. I, I did one earlier. There's a faction one uh, that you can take where you get actual faction tokens and all sorts of other stuff. And it, it's kind of their version of a dungeon, I guess. It's always there. They're always procedural. You go through, and they're always slightly different due to kind of interdimensional shenanigans. Uh, and it was two, and it said it was going to take 40, 40 minutes is what their their time estimate was. This one didn't give me a time estimate, but... Um, Most of these most of these doors on the edge don't open. If you don't see anything out, then it's it's not meant for you to explore. But anyway, yeah, I'm a little bit surprised we haven't seen anything else. Or I'm a little bit surprised we've gone this far and we haven't seen anything else, I guess, is the We've killed a lot of dudes. Oh, there we go. There's some more. Coming back, coming back. Coming back, boys. Or girls, mostly, in this case. One, two, at least there's, there's at least four. 
Um, gonna kind of sprint. this way. Same thing here. Make him come around the corner to us. Not much chance there, is there? Whoops. I will pop her barrier, because she's kind of on the front there. Get a couple to move in on us here. There we go, that's better. Oh, nice, came in for the melee. That was lovely. They make good noises. See what I mean about being on the edge there? All right. Um, we'll start with our pistol special ability because it's up. Flip over to the shotgun and give you a face full of shotgun slugs. There we go. Then another pistol special. Um, I might stay on the pistol this time because we're close uh, and the rifle gets decreased. Oh, jeez. Multiple 68s missed. There we go. We still caught him, but man, two misses and a graze for zero damage. Um, anyway, the shotgun loses accuracy in close like that. Um, he's the one that shot that fire at us, probably. Hey, our skill with big guns is improved. I think that means we can use one of those other big guns. I think that's what that means. Ah, that was a mistake. Oh, wait, none of that's good. Move out here. This guy needs some killing, apparently. Um, that's gonna be two. Is this three? Can we get one more big attack off? Oh, put him down, yeah. All right, I'm gonna face this way. I don't think it matters, but you know what? It just makes me feel better about it. All right, you're coming out. It's like a zombie monk or something. Do I have a movement? No, not yet. I come to here. I should still have enough for a shotgun blast. Um. Ouch. Shock. See, grenades when used against you hurt. Um, we're going to use this. Okay, we did a little bit. Um, I have five left. Okay, we did pretty well. Oh, tell that we did well. Oh, no. I thought we were doing well. Um, I'm going to move to here. Actually, I'm going to do medical. Hey, our first aid. I don't know how often we have to use that for that, but I'll take it. Uh, switch weapons. I should probably be using more health packs just because I have a boatload of them and to get our skill up. 
I mean, that's right there seems to be a good enough reason. All right, I think we can get both of them with this. Nope. Is it pistol up? No, not yet. We're still getting 63 accuracy for this, so I think that's... All right, where's he going? Went after Rome, okay. Um. Can we do a first aid kit? No, not enough AP, okay. However, can we do one ourselves? Yes, we can. Turn around here, get him with the special, the thermal. New perk, you can you choose a balanced approach, plus five damage and plus 5% to our AC, nice. And he dropped a rare loot. So every once in a while, instead of just this normal little kind of backpack, they actually drop this special chest. And you can see up top, the right, our little running man there turned green. So we've cleared this area. I don't think you're guaranteed to get this on this last guy. I did get one very early in the game uh, with some good stuff in it. Um, which kind of set me up, honestly, for the for this playthrough. All right. Let's do a quick reload. And we'll take a look at what loot we picked up. I've been going for an hour, so I'll probably end this one here. Like I said, I've got, what, four more of these things to go? These dungeons are, are big. This game is going to have... It's gonna have some hours in it if that's something that interests you. Look, it just looks cool. So one-handed melee level four. Well, clearly we're not there yet, right? That'd be you. Um, what is our, we got some level ups in there. Our one-handed melee's up to three, or two-handed melee's up to three. And you can see, if we go here, you can see how close she is to four. This is the XP for that level. And that's, oh, that's pretty close too. All right, well, we're getting really close, so definitely we hang on to that, right? Um, it's got two mod slots. It does the same amount of damage. It doesn't look like it's got much else. I don't really know sometimes what the benefit of these are. Now, you can see the weapon we have down there has a value of 24,000, and this one only has a value of 4,700. So it may be that it's just, it would be better than a normal level two, but the level two we have is epic. And this is, but this is legendary, which you'd think would be more, but it has fewer mod slots. So I assume that means it's one step behind, two mod slots versus three. Um, so yeah, I might just sell it. I mean, it's worth money. Let's sell it. All right. Um, how about you, Mr. Pistol? Um, I'm going to go ahead and repair you for real quick first. It's a difficult repair. All right. Uh, let's go to somebody who uses a pistol. How about you? Um, is it better than what you have? Yes, because it has three slots and this one doesn't have any. And we have a handful of slots we can use and you're, you're fine. See, look at that. Now that one's got a, a 23,000 worth worth 462, but they have the same amount of damage. Um, I'm going to, uh, you're not really worried. I'm going to salvage you. All right, so this is just equips to all. Agility and strength. Agility and strength. Or dex and strength. Oh, dex and agility, excuse me. You know what? I think the stuff that's strength, I really just want to put on her. And this has three slots. So you know what? I'm just going to put... Oh, I can only have one of those on at a time. Only one of the type. Hmm. Agility, strength. Well, we'll go with that one. That's fine. Um, we'll worry about the rest of that in a minute. Uh, BFG requires big guns level one. Let's go to our big gun person. Is it better than what we have? Well, we can repair it real fast while we think about it. Um, it's explosive versus kinetic, so it gets us a different weapon type. 16 to 86, it's a single shot. Um, it takes missiles. I don't have a lot of missiles. I got 19 of them, though. Uh, no, six of them. You know what? Let's give it a go. So it's a bazooka that shoots a, 
a missile. Yeah. For now, let's let's kick it over there. Um, tooled half, legendary, equips to melee, chance to hit 16. Uh, that's pretty good, yes. We'll throw that in there. All right, so this is good armor, but not quite good enough. Although endurance, well, endurance and perception. Uh, let's go and repair this too. All right, 12. But it has, it's worth less because it's only an agility, not a strength and an intelligence boost. Hmm. This one's also 12, just perception. Uh, you know what? That armor needs to be repaired too while we're standing here. Everything else in reasonable shape? Yeah. Um, so it's just, just more armor. Well, agility helps in melee combat. So let's go for that. Um, yeah. All right, so... How about how about our primary character? What's your armor like? It's oh, wait, so that one's better perception, which I do like. I'd use dis, I mean perception. I do consider my primary stat for this character, but Dex and three endurance is pretty damn good uh, from a hit point standpoint. Uh, yeah, I think I'm I think I'm okay there. Uh, well, it's better than that because it has stat bonuses. That's better armor. Yeah, I think that's okay. You, we looked at. How about F4? Um, two bonuses, I think, is probably better than one armor. But that's two bonuses and one armor. And that's one better yet. So there we go. Uh, are you worth anything? No. I'm going to salvage you. Uh, you're worth something. You are not. You are not. Um, and you can go on anything. Uh, you know what? I'm going to put this on you. Oh, no. I've got a bunch of heavy weapon stuff. Hold on. No, that's not what I want. Uh, you, you. Let's take a look at heavy weapons. Um, I have, oh, I might have some heavy weapons too. Um, what does that require? Level two? All right. Um, extended mag, pistol, that is for a rifle. That's for everything. Heavy weapon accelerator. All right. So this has one slot. We've got a handful of things we could put. We could just go for perception and a chance to hit. Again, we probably don't want to miss with this very often. Um, that's just more damage. And that's yet more damage. You know what? I'm going to just go for the more damage. So, yeah, potentially a lot, especially if it's just one roll rather than an eight times whatever, right? I guess that's not really going to matter in the long run, but. Um, all right, does anybody else have any open slots that they can do something with? You have a hammer. I don't think anything is going to go in there. That needs arranged. Um you don't have any open slots. You've got all sorts of open slots, though. So you could get that. Whoops. Come on. Uh, oops. So let's go back. Well, that's a pistol. So I have... Oh, well, hold on. First of all, is that a better pistol? Needs level five. I'll stick with the one I have for now. Um, we've got the extended magazine capacity. M bigger extended magazine capacity and a grip. 
Okay. Well, I think we can only have one magazine, right? So that one's 16, that one's 12. Let's toss that on there. And then we'll go ahead and throw the grip on there for an additional dex and chance to hit. Whoops, come on. It's a little fiddly sometimes. And there we go. I mean, you can see how much all this stuff is adding up into our stats there. Um, and you can see all that. So I went in this one here because we've been going for about an hour and seven minutes so far. And I still have to figure out the southern entrance to this thing. Um, was there more loot up here by chance? How about how about in here? You could you, oh yeah, see look, they hid one little thing up there. All right, this is hacking. Hacking's hard for me because I would like to use my 10 key skills, but when I've been grabbing the mouse all day, my fingers don't work very well. What's gonna happen is if you do a regular hack, it's gonna throw through the numbers, it's gonna tell you what the number is, you have to hit it in a certain amount of time. That time's gonna go down as it goes across. So we're gonna go zero. Eight, nine, seven, one, and I got it. Um, because I've been talking more, my hand's in pretty good shape. Uh, and there's, we didn't really get much out of it. Some stuff that I'm going to quickly add to the salvage roster there. Um, put that back in the deal. And then I'm going to sell that one. I'm going to sell that one. We'll go to salvage, uh, add all junk. Dissemble all. We got to level eight on our on our salvaging. Nice. And only this one here. Thanks for watching, guys. Um, I'll be back later. I'm I'm having a really good time playing this game right now. Uh, there's a lot of space combat. There's mining. There's some other things going on. So I might be back to show you some additional. Um, is my camera working? I guess it is. Um, aspects of the game. Anyway, we'll see you next time. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Don't forget to subscribe. Membership down below. Discord down below. Cheers.